What's up, fight fans? This is Kurt DeVille with Counterpunch Boxing News, and I have some new news concerning Luis Ortiz and Dillian White. Okay, Dillian White has stated that he offered Luis Ortiz $2 million for his, um, to fight him at the O2 Arena in London, okay, in the UK. Now, we've seen videos of Dillian White stating this. Okay. What my question is, I want to know what is happening lately. Dillian White's looking for an opponent, man. And if Luis Ortiz, every time he's interviewed, he's stating, hey, I want to fight anyone. The same for Dillian White. But when you hear Dillian White talk about Luis Ortiz, he's talking about the times that he's offered him fights. I can see how that can be frustrating. I can see how people can be content with um, the attempts of trying to make a fight happen with Luis Ortiz. What I'm saying is Dillian White should make one more or, or reach out to Luis Ortiz again if he wants that type of name because Dillian White is the kind of guy that he has to keep fighting the high caliber of fighters because he's not where he wants to be or where he needs to be in the sport. And where he is in the sport, it's that guy that was once like Canelo. Remember Canelo after he took the L from Floyd? He was fighting everybody. He was fighting the Laras. He was fighting the Trouts. He was fighting, you know, and then until, until he got a little clout back and then, you know, he started back with, you know, uh, uh, fighting guys like Khan and, you know, you know, avoiding Golovkin. But Dillian White was once Canelo at one point. He wanted to fight everybody and he should keep that status quo. Um, we know what he was offered, Luis Ortiz, but we don't know what he is offering present tense okay like we can always hear about fighters offering these these other fighters uh, a certain amount you know and we hear what happened past tense but we don't really hear what's happening you know what's currently going on with negotiations you know have they offered Luis Ortiz since December because this is not December guys this is April let's be real you know he needs an opponent and that is the best guy, according to boxing icons himself, his poll. Everyone wants to see that fight across the board out of 2,600 votes. They want to see Luis King Kong Ortiz. So guess what? I'm not alone with that. And if he offers, now mind you, if he offers, not offered, offers Luis Ortiz two thousand or two million dollars or two million pounds, and Ortiz and his team, they decide to go another route, they ducking. There I've said it. It doesn't matter if I'm a fan of Ortiz. It doesn't matter if I like his boxing skills. It, none of that matters. You know what I mean? And truth be told, that if he is ducking, who's behind the duck? Is it just Luis Ortiz? Is his team? Is his team influenced by uh, PBC? Because that's who he fights under, right? So that's that. You, you Look, we can throw that on the shelf on the 13th floor <laughs> we could throw that shit on the thir 13th floor with the typical pbc bullshit because that's exactly what we have you got fighters that that say they want big fights and then when money offered to them they don't take the shit you know luis ortiz would be in the same shelf as deontay wilder they can claim that these guys don't want to fight me and these guys don't want to make the fight and then a fight gets offered then all of a sudden oh um uh you know what no we're, we're gonna go another route See, that's bullshit, you know, but we have to know that first. We have to know if Luis Ortiz is offered fights like that with uh, Dillian White, because that is the fight that needs to happen. OK, we've got the Dillian White and Parkers. We've got the Dillian White Chisaurus part two. You know what I mean? We have all these fights. OK, we have the Lucas Brown Dillian White, you know. So, look, he has to keep this thing going. And if he stops Luis Ortiz, that rips the leg from Deontay Wilder, as we all know, that would be his only credible win. And you know, of all, all people, if you don't know, now you know, if a fighter beats a good fighter or that fighter that was one that was rumored to be good and he, that fighter then keeps getting beat, that takes credibility from the fighter that beat him, okay? Which in this case would be Deontay Wilder. So we want to see these fights and I want to see these fights happen and I want to see this fight happen. So the question is, what deals are taking place right now? You guys tell me what you think about Luis Ortiz, Dillian White making the next fight for these two opponents. Tell me what you think. Of course, please subscribe. And you guys been counterpunched. Peace.